Good day, good day! <laughs> How the honk are ya? Welcome to Roverland. This is your friend Dan O. And guess what we got for you today? Yeah, we've got an interesting little bugger here. This is a tester's metal body model kit. Metal. This is a Land Rover. Look at that. Would you imagine that? Yes. Uh, yeah, so very, very interesting. 143rd scale, second level, uh, 8 plus. So I won't be putting this together. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so let's talk a little bit. I got two of them. Uh, one is uh, in a sealed package. So, uh, you know, we're not going to take a look at that one. Uh, but uh, this one is uh, not sealed and uh, it's kind of open. So let's just take a look at the uh, box here. Now, I did not find out um, when this really was produced. Um, that does have a date on there, but uh, I think that's for the Land Rover group. Uh, so anyway, if you guys don't know anything, oh, 2000 year 2000 it says up there hopefully that's kind of when they put this together testers they do uh, quite a few i mean they're a modeling company and uh so they put this out i believe i bought these from walmart back when walmart used to sell uh model kits and uh so this is a pre-painted body and uh four three ought 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 uno is the kit number and just uh, really kind of cool only came in red as far as I could find um, and and this is this is quite a series there I don't know like 40 some cars I think in the metal body uh, model kits I think something like that but there's only one Land Rover and it's this Freelander and they don't say that it's a Freelander they just say Land Rover so you've got to know what you're looking at to know what you're looking at and uh, so uh, yeah and so not a lot of information on these um, you know they're uh, kind of uh, I lost my ruler uh, to try to open this up hold on a second I gotta find my ruler I found my ruler yeah it was uh, holding back a, a line of cars from rolling off the desk <laughs> that's a it was a curb. It was a curb. All right, I'm trying to get this open without damaging the box at all. There we go. Nicely done. Thank you very much. All right. So, um, oh, ah, we didn't even look at the back of the box because that's what it is right there. Pretty, pretty nice. Yeah, pretty nice. Can't beat that at all. So let's see what we've got going on here, huh? Just slide this out. Nice little uh, box inside the box, a tray. I don't know if I've ever opened this bugger up before. So let's just take a look at what we've got here. We'll look at the uh, destructions first. <laughs> oh, here we go, finally, Land Rover Freelander. And kit number there. Yeah, very nice. Uh, we have English and we have uh, I don't know, is that Spanish or is that uh, French? I'm not sure. Could not tell you. I think it's French. All right, so anyway, one one sheet of paper there. It's just uh, all just kind of folded up there. And uh, wow, there you go. Uh, yeah, that's uh, French. Okay, I've made an executive decision. That's French. So here we go, just an exploded view, not a step-by-step -step, uh, what to do or uh, anything like that. Very kind of cool. Just a whole big exploded view. But you can call them Monday through Friday. <laughs> All right, I don't know if I'd call them or not, but hey, if you want, go ahead and call them. Give me, let me know what happens. All right. <laughs> All right. So there you go. Um, cement or uh, not to cement. There you go. Oh, so here you go. So if the dot. The dot is dark, you cement it. If it's clear, you don't cement it. Where's a clear one? Right there, 13. You put the, the 
floor on a chassis without cementing. There you go. Oh, and the screws. Yeah, don't cement those in. All right. Well, really kind of interesting. That's that's really kind of interesting for a second level uh, toy. Oh, wow. Look at this. I've, I've never opened this up. Oh, my goodness. Look at this little cute little bugger here. It is just a 143rd scale, isn't it? Interesting. So I wonder who owns this uh, casting then. Um... I mean, uh, Bur Burgo bought it from him. I, I wonder who owns this. Uh, the the die, the die casting. Who's making these nowadays? I wonder. But uh, really kind of cool. Really kind of cool. Uh, interestingly enough, I went on eBay here in the United States, and uh, you can buy one of these kits for uh, twenty nine dollars right now. Uh, the last time I checked. So really kind of cool there. Yeah, kind of spendy. I did not pay that much. I don't know. Did that other box have a price on it? Didn't have a price on it. Yeah, I don't know exactly what I uh, paid for these, but I, I got two of them. Yeah, very neat. Here's all the black parts and the black spur. And then there's uh, gray parts. Now, interestingly enough... Uh, hmm... Oh, okay. I was kind of worried. I didn't see any black tires in there. I, uh, yeah, I was hoping that they were in there, but I saw a peek in there. Here's the seats here. And the gray, a gray spur. Sorry for the glare there, but just trying to show you exactly what I got. Steering wheel, dash. Nice, some quarter panels there with the, oh, there's the uh, front dash there. What's that other part? Oh, center console? Yeah, interesting, interesting. All right, what do we got? We got one more in here. All right, another, oh yeah, here are the wheels. Take a look at those. Very cool, very cool. So the only thing that's painted is the uh, body, body work. And uh, actually that is, uh, we'll, we'll have to take another look at that because I just remembered that this is a, uh, Body, body painted full metal kit. All right, here's the clear glass. We've got a windshield. Inserts on the headlamps and stuff. Do a little painting there. Yep, there you go. So really kind of cool. And then now here are the tires. Oh, hey, look this. This is cool. I even got the uh, screws and axles with some more decals that go on the uh, dash and stuff. That's kinda kinda cool. Yeah, very, very cool, yeah. Uh, oh yeah, so here are the tires. Nice little uh, buggers there. Not too, uh, they're not off-road tires. Nice, nice street tires, nice clear uh, rubber, rubber tires, nice clear, uh, tread on them. Awesome. Awesome. All right. Kind of put that back in order maybe, huh? If I can remember, I was just there. I should remember. <laughs> so really kind of cool. I, you know, did I see uh, how many pieces that was? I don't know if I actually saw how many pieces that was. Uh, does it tell you as far as uh, pieces on the, uh, no, yeah, huh, uh, usually sometimes they tell you how many uh, pieces is, it is, you know, kind of uh, as a uh, heads up of what you got, but this one doesn't. Anyway, let's take a little look, better look at this. Yeah, it does have, uh, yeah, it is painted, it's got the, uh, is that the balance you'd want it? No, uh, windshield, what do you call that now, I forgot, oh jeez balls. Uh, ha door handle, got the Land Rover badge on the side there. The window trim is painted black. It's pretty nice. Silver, silver backing on there. Oh, and a uh, Land Rover detail uh, on the uh, license plate holder there. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, gas cap is painted. And of course, it, it does have the uh, Land Rover 
across the front of the hood. So really kind of cool. I like that. So 143rd scale. Yeah, really kind of, really kind of small. Let's take a quick measurement. Let's give it to you in centimeters today. Yeah, over uh, three and a half inches, nine centimeters almost. Yeah, so really kind of cool. I like that a lot. That is really cool. I, like I said, I don't know. I, I, I never did. I can tell you from the way I had to open this box up, never had opened it. Never had. So there you goes. Thanks very much for joining me today for a Tester's Land Rover uh, metal body kit. Got a couple of kits in the playlist. We're going to show you that uh, later on so you can uh, go ahead and watch the rest of them. Come on over to Roverland on Facebook and Instagram, Roverland channel. And uh, thank you very much for joining me. I'm your friend Dano, and this is Roverland, the channel that's all about anything and everything Land Rover. Make sure you give me a big thumbs up. I'm going to give you a big thumbs right now. That's how you do it. And subscribe if you like what you see. We'll have more neat things about Land Rover toys and models coming up. All right. As I say and all my friends, remember, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great Rover day.